Welcome back to Project 613. Today we are going to learn another mitzvah on the topic of testimony. And that is that when it comes to capital crimes and a, a witness that has come forth to give testimony about a capital crime, once he's given his testimony, it is forbidden for him to serve on the panel of judges dealing with that case. Of course, we can understand the reason for this is because this individual will already be biased. He's already witnessed the case and already has an opinion based on what he's seen. Therefore, he cannot serve as a judge on this case. In the words of the Talmud, Ein Eid Na Sedayin, a witness cannot then go and become a judge. But when it comes to capital cases, it's even more than that. Not only can this witness not become a judge, it is forbidden for him even to offer any argument, whether for or against the individual he is testifying about. He is only allowed to state the facts as he's seen them, and that's it. He cannot offer any of his own arguments for or against the case once he's given his testimony. When it comes to other cases, when it comes to regular financial disputes, over there it's slightly different, where even though, even when it comes to financial disputes, it's also true that someone who has testified cannot serve on the panel of judges. However, the witnesses, when it comes to a financial case, are allowed to offer their own arguments whether in favor or against either of the parties. But that is something that's only allowed when it comes to financial disputes, when it comes to capital cases, even that is not allowed. They are only allowed to give their testimony, and that is it. Have a wonderful, wonderful day.